Hello, Phil the Meerkat here. Welcome to another episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy V. There are going to be a lot of enemies here. Um, I will just have to hope that I can get through them, I guess. But uh, I don't know how many of these. On the one hand, if you're playing along with us, I don't want to not show you where to go. On the other hand, I think it's going to be pretty clear that you just go where these sands drag you to. And um, I'm, I'm fairly certain that's going to be pretty boring, actually watching me go through this, so I'm not really sure what to do here. These bombs are a stable part of uh, Final Fantasy games. These ones don't seem to explode when they're... Oh, they do. Alright, fine. Okay. There. I am not fighting these guys because I think the game would probably want to be horrible to me at this point and try to destroy me, basically, now that I'm so close to the end. So, this town might be just ruinous with no people in it, which would be unfortunate because I could really, really, really do some items here, especially if there's going to be a boss. I guess this is that town of ruins Sid was talking about. Well, there are, it is ruinous, it's, uh, there's no doubt about that. That was King Tycoon. It was, yes. But I want to just make sure that there aren't any useful items hidden. Seems to want to not be spotted. 
get as far as I can go. Am I supposed to catch him? Father! Papa? Okay, let's hope there's a shop down here, because I really can't afford a boss battle. If this is a boss battle, then I don't know, I guess I'm done with this game, because uh, I'm I'm not going to be able to, to go on with... Uh, with uh, amount of potions and magic and stuff that I've got right now. Faris! I knew it, you really are my sister. I think we probably could have guessed by what that siren um, the boss was doing just after we went through the dose ships. I'm sorry, I wasn't certain at first, and then I didn't think I should tell you. Sister, Lana. Well, pretty much everyone has a secret on this game. Uh, where are we? This place is strange. So, what happened to the old man? Huh? He's not here? We must have gotten separated when we fell. Well, it looked like he was trying to get us to fall down this hole. I don't really trust him. He'll be okay. He's a tough old cuss. I'm sure we'll run into him again later. Come on, let's get going. Now wait one cotton pick a minute. That was an awfully quick decision to ditch me. Yikes! Uh, sorry. Any shops around here? I only really need one. Ugh, there, was, there aren't going to be, are there? Look, look, game, seriously. If this is a boss, I'm not going to be able to beat it. I'm just not. What is this? Please transport me to somewhere where I can get stuff to buy, please. Look, I'm only human, okay? I, I wasn't expecting to, to not have stuff. Look out! Oh, it's the boss, isn't it? I realise that games can't be super easy, but... Meanwhile... Okay, they did let it run away. Oh no, they didn't. Good. East, west, home is best. Even if you're a chuck about, eh? Bart should be thrilled. Went above and beyond the call of duty. No, you didn't! I told you, do not let it run away. You need it as transport outside of whatever location we end up in. Phew, that was close. I suppose that was a warp device. After not being used for so long, activate it must have caused an overload. Don't suppose there's any chance that there's an exit here, is there? 
Oh, thank goodness. I still need items, but at least there's this. One of the problems with computer games is not being able to predict beforehand what will happen. There's a place where I can buy stuff. Yeah, it won't budge, huh? Something is carved into the wall. Check planters in the centre room. Okay. Don't know what planters are, but... These planters? Guess not. I still haven't found the centre room yet. Oh, I did, and I just wasn't aware of it. This is... Hey, it's a fire-powered shop. Shit. Shop? I don't know. Uh, you can tell what's on my mind, at least. I thought it had sunk. But what's that ship over there? Pairs on the boat. What's that? What's up with that? It's an airship, I would guess. Sid, mid. Ow. What the? Bart, Lena, Faris, Galuf. What are you guys doing here? I think that's our line. Where do you guys come from? We rode the black truck boat across an island. Then, all of a sudden, a hole opened up beneath us and we fell. Wait, so we're underneath Crescent Island? That explains the fire-powered ship here. This place must have been built by the ancients. Huh, and this repair ship? Um, maybe you should ask Grandpa about that. Sir? Wait, where'd he go? Alright, before I do that, I just want to go and check that we haven't actually already been in the centre room, because I would assume it meant the centre room of that specific building, and I really want to get what's in those chests, so... Okay, well, it seems like um, there's, no there's nothing. So, it must mean the centre room on the ship. That's the only thing I could think of, and I'm hoping it'll be obvious what that means. Hot diggity dang! This is apparently something he says. This is mind-blowing! I suppose it's possible it's the centre room on the fire ship, but I didn't really see anything last time I was in there that was obvious. I said, don't bother me, boyo. 
Right in this and adjust this rightly tightly, leftly loosely. Voila! This should do it. That should do what? That should get the ship moving. Well, whatever that centre room thing means, if it's too light, then I have no idea. Wow, amazing! Said, so, what is this thing? Isn't that obvious? It's an airship. Amazing! Have only ever seen these in old texts in Final Fantasy IV. I can't believe I'm getting to use one in the flash. Uh, well, you know what I mean. Off. Off. I'm not sure how to pronounce off. Off. What was that? Something's dragging us down. Well, this ship hasn't lasted for long. Never mind. Creepy quarters. Some monsters got a death grip on the ship's hull. And we have a boss. Hopefully an easy boss. See. Well, ice seems to work okay. Uh, not going to be easy this one though. Wow. Oh, okay. Hope that wasn't the boss. Ha! Ah, looks like that overgrown lo lobster just got served. With cheese and biscuits and mashed potatoes. Which doesn't sound like it really goes together, does it? Mashed potatoes and cheese and lobster. Anyway. Looks like damage to the ship was minimal. We can use parts from the fire powered ship to make the airship good as new. They really ought to have called it the fire ship. It just sounds better. Sid, if you're just going to thank me, I don't need to hear it. We'll stay here and search for some clues about the earth crystal. The skies are yours, kids. Now get out of here. Leave a warlock. X death. We must prevent him from returning. All that's left is the Earth Crystal. I doubt that. Having played Final Fantasy games before, I really doubt that. No point in dawdling. Let's go. I can see an excellent point in dawdling, which is that I didn't manage to find the centre room. I'm pretty certain that I'm missing something here. Which is why I'm going to go back. I would also like to save, so... I don't suppose it's, this is the centre room, is it? I mean, I would have said this was the engine room. I intend to find out where we would get these items from, how we would obtain them. Great googly moogly, what a discovery!
So many got so little time. Okay, well there really is no obvious solution to this. I think I'm gonna take this to um well actually it would probably make more sense if I get to the nearest town to get some more items. Um okay, I am gonna end the episode then. I will see you next time.